everyone, and welcome to the stream. It's me, Rogie Rack Rat. I'm back. <laughs> Don't know what's with the feet. All right, rancid foot milk. Sure. <laughs> but yes, I am almost at 50 followers, which is great. Thanks everyone who has given me a follow, <laughs> including uh, Lord Belvoir, who did it between streams. But <laughs> Well, very good. They, they're certainly feet. <laughs> well, welcome. All right. So, this might be the finale of Inscription. I'm not sure. Because I'm in the second half of the game. So, spoilers if you're not familiar with uh, where this game goes. And I think I just have two of the four bosses left. So, uh, you know, there might be something after that. Who knows? <laughs> All right. And here we go. <laughs> yeah, it's been really good. I mean, I am a sucker for games that, uh, you know, are very meta and also have puzzles and stuff like that. <laughs> right, so we just defeated this guy, yep. Um, how am I doing on 11? I think that's... I wonder if that might be enough for another Ouroboros card, because having more of them would certainly be great. <laughs> or actually... Oh, wait, did it... Oh, the stock rotated when I bought it, right. <laughs> Ball of squirrels. <laughs> yeah. I wish. Anyway. <laughs> or whatever. Don't really need it. Anyway. So the other thing... <laughs> Thanks so much, Sasha. I enjoy your guys' streams as well. So... <laughs> I'm only happy when we can be mutually beneficial. Yes. So two bosses left. Oh, I didn't defeat Leshy. Right. And... We got the magic one who I haven't even faced yet. Um, so initially I picked the robot deck, which means I'm going to replace the robot boss, but, uh, it sounds like I might be able to change that choice later, and I don't know, I'm thinking about maybe replacing this guy, because he sure was a real jerk to us <laughs> when we were in the cabin. <laughs> um, that's a good question. I've, I've given it a little thought, but I don't have anything specific planned. Or, well, I don't know, definitely maybe, like, some costume change stuff, maybe some sound alerts, maybe even having, like, uh, people be able to, like, pick a future game that I play, if there's something <laughs> they'd like to see. <laughs> I don't know. Still, still giving it some thought, but, uh, yeah, haven't, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. All right, so, back to this guy his animals. Right. Um, this could be an okay starting hand. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's give it a try. I mean, it doesn't seem like there's any penalty to losing <laughs> anymore, so, or so much, so. Alright. Pick up that coyote. Um, or actually, uh, and get rid of the skeleton. That's Mantis got to take out that coyote. I'm gonna send a frog after me. That won't do the job. <laughs> oh right, I could have summoned this last time, and I guess I did. Uh, kind of don't want it to die, but eh, why not have it block? And right, I'm gonna. Oh, well. <laughs> Got taken out. <laughs> um, right, and he's gonna have a second form, isn't he? Alright, Leafbot's about to die, so let's get this mole man out. <laughs> Trigger fire. That's one I'm not familiar with. 
I mean, I am excited to maybe try, uh, I know there's, like, uh, games that have that crowd control, use the crowd control extension, including the Zelda randomizers, which I've had a little, or I've had a little experience with the uh, Zelda Link to the Past randomizer, but I'm not sure if that works with channel points, or is it only with bits? Anyway, whatever. <laughs> I'll have to give it some thought. All right, uh, Plasma Jimmy. Uh, da, 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 da. We could summon him and shoot the stoat down. Yes. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, I, I know how the activated ability works. Thank you. There we go. First time actually getting Plasma Jimmy up on the board, even though I think I have a couple copies. <laughs> okay, got one of these conduits. But I don't have a second one to complete the circuit, I don't think. Not currently. Uh, oh! I can put up the shutter bug, though. Nice. Death works even on the sentry shot, or well. Oh no, it's it's got a oh, right sentry, so it shoots when they're coming out, not when they're whatever. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I like the this <laughs> kind of more old school soundtrack in this section. <laughs> it's cool. Um, well, sure. Why not take? Why not bring out a necromancer? <laughs> Guess I'm not doing a ton of damage, but I didn't need to. But of course, he has a second life. If you need these, I have something better. You never did finish your death card. There wasn't enough death. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Now these amalgams of. Oh, they. Oh, he merged the Mantis God's cost with a squirrel and just a 1-1 creature? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's not super useful. <laughs> Alright. Uh, well, you're out of luck, Mole Man. Just gonna shoot you all the way to down. <laughs> so honestly, I'm, I'm also not even sure how long this game's gonna last. Uh... I mean, I'm not sure it'll last the whole two hours that I usually stream on Mondays. <laughs> but, uh, we'll see. And, you know, if there's extra time, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> oh, he's got a grizzly bear. Um... Uh, and also, this mole man's about to die. So... Hmm. Uh, I could get a sh All right, you know what? Maybe I take out Plasma Jimmy for now. Because I need to either do more damage or do more blocking. So, you know what? Let's put that there and let's get the meat bot out. Future sec. Okay, uh, don't need the extra energy from this guy. Kind of out of blood, though. Oh, actually, wait. No, I'll just beat him. Let's just win. <laughs> don't need extra foil cards at this point. Hope, oh, maybe not. Yeah. <laughs> yep, you're not the scribe in charge of this game anymore. <laughs> So there was some talk that, like, you know, well, clearly, somehow Leshy got control over the entire game and was imprisoning the other scribes, but, uh, they keep talking like basically any of the others would have done the same because they're all power-hungry. <laughs> so, 
so I don't know. But still, seems like Fleshy's a bad guy. <laughs> but maybe they're all bad guys. <laughs> I mean, former Stoat, PO3, sure is a, a jerk. <laughs> but maybe not in an evil way. <laughs> I don't know. They were able to defeat me, beggar's belief, but now I must yield to you. The only regret is our battle was so brief. <laughs> Surely the summon of this victory is made sweeter by a more arduous ascent. I mean, it sure was a satisfying victory when I beat you the first time. <laughs> oh, got a cat. Nine lives. Or infinite lives. I'm still curious if, like, combining two broken ovals on the board will, uh, sum summon something cool, but, uh, I don't know. <laughs> And I'm, at this point, I've got a deck that works pretty well together, so. Really? I didn't have a bullfrog yet in this one? <laughs> That's fine. Guy with beasts. Okay. Oh. Oh, he's still got pack rat with him, also. <laughs> what is that? What is what? Oh. Um, hi. <laughs> I had to see your face after you lost. Is so bad. Ugh. Yeah, the smugness. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> so I wonder we're back here again. And we would have been even sooner if the disc wasn't lost. <laughs> Take a long look at this face. <laughs> Guess you'll never see it again. <laughs> I'm done being your pet, you stinky beast. <laughs> yes. Stowed forever surly, but yeah. I pushed it too far that last time. <laughs> Why don't they see? To live as a beast would be the noblest thing. <laughs> Even so lowly a creature as a stoat. Hmm. Eh. <laughs> Debatable. <laughs> anyway. That's going dog. No, not, not interested. <laughs> Wait a minute. He wants so this guy wants corrupted fish. The robot PO3 wanted they said, ooh, wait a minute, mushroom house. It's a Mario thing, not a, anyway. Um yeah, I was gonna say PO3, like they were also like, oh, some corrupted ore or whatever. He'll definitely want that. But I don't know. Oh, it's this guy! The mushroom, mushroom guy, who makes amalgam creatures. Uh-oh, <laughs> you have found us here. This is good? <laughs> this is good. <laughs> we require duplicates. Yep, sure. Sure. Will I make the grave digger spit out two bones, maybe? I don't know. Yep. <laughs> sure, why not? Oh, he's all mushroomy now. <laughs> Spore digger. Huh. Alright. Cool. What are those rats? Not a kind of rat I've encountered in the game. Hmm. Weird. Do those options change? No. Okay. <laughs> Is there any secrets over here? No? Okay. Oh right, there's the there's this crypt down here that I still didn't find the answer to. Oops. <laughs> Hello. I have no offering. Right, okay. I don't know what I would offer it. <laughs> Alright, and let's check by the docks again. Scrap. 
type only. <laughs> In case bad happen. <laughs> Backup plan. Hmm. Hmm. That's a little ominous. Hi, Rebecca. <laughs> Sees challenges as you explain things. Yep, that certainly was the case. <laughs> Of different types of cards in your deck to fully utilize your bones, blood, and energy. Yep. Don't know why she makes wolf sounds. <laughs> Unclear. I mean, I have been using that mix of energy, blood, and bones. I haven't been using magic because that seems like, I don't know, this whole thing with gems. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll try this game again sometime. All right. Final scribe. What's up? What is this, a note? Greetings, you are reading this. It must be because you wish to challenge me, Magnificus, in card battle. Earn, earn the privilege of first defeat my three graduate students. That, I mean, that fits the pattern. We've been defeating three challengers every time. As for their whereabouts, that is for you to discover. Sincerely, Magnificus. Alright. So, right. Magnificus is the scribe that was the old wolf. Caged wolf. Oh, yep. Got a puzzle going here. Looks like the. Actually, that one's new, but the rest of these seem like the card sigils. Alright. Let me guess. So, let me see hidden stuff. Strange monocle. <laughs> okay. Alright. Skull, wing, skull. Easy enough. Right, because it was... Oh, Well, I guess I found one of the students. <laughs> oh, nice, I've even got the monocle on. <laughs> Cute. But yeah, because it was like a... I did need a weird eyeball to find the wolf in the first place, I think. <laughs> or am I forgetting? No, no, that was after I got him, I think. Anyway. Bane is unbearable. My organs are melting. <laughs> Do you see? Magnificus turned me into a goo for my final exam. I just need to defeat one more challenger. I will earn my rightful place. Rightful place in the deck of, ma of the master as one of his prize cards. Or nothing will stop me. Well, sorry, buddy. I mean, as much as I'd like to free you from this torment, <laughs> it seems like, uh... Oh, jeez. Uh... Hmm. Okay. Seems like these wizards will be... Powered by this thing. Certainly is a nice opening move for him that he can summon all those guys at once. <laughs> Ooh, got a curve hopper. That's probably good early on. Um It's not the best hand though. Let's re-roll. Okay. This is fine. Yeah, I can shoot the gem as it's coming out. Easy peasy. Yeah. And then what, he has no answer for that? <laughs> Not even summoning anything. Alright, let's get that meat bot out, and then immediately summon, sacrifice him for a grizzly bear. <laughs> Heavy hitter. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Free energy, because why not? Um, I could do another free energy by sacrificing again, but... Nah. Let's leave it at that. Mm. Now I'll wait a turn. There we go. Now they're powerless, and the grizzly bear kills the other mage. Nice. Factory conduit. I mean, that would be good if I combine it with that power conduit from before. 
Um, but I can just... Yeah, let's go for a massive overkill victory. <laughs> there we go. Eight damage. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows? Never know when I'll need more foils. No, please. <laughs> Just tell the master I passed. Aw. <laughs> you won't know the difference. <laughs> All right. Fiend's Mox. It provides green gem and blue gem. All right. Gem friend. Gem fiend. Sorry. <laughs> hmm. Weird. All right. Squirrel ball. Yeah. <laughs> Here, I can open the door for you. What do you want to bet that the uh, so he was the green one? What do you want to bet that the next two are gonna be blue and red? <laughs> Given the <laughs> pattern going on here. Stim mage. Take free energy to activate power. Increase the power and health of the stim mage. Hmm. And that seems cool, but I'd also need a green gem to summon. So. All right, you can just take random packs as well. Ooh, what is... Oh, it's like a card collection? I mean, I have the modified deck thing in my menu. Isn't that the same? Ooh, wait a minute. That's the secret. Yeah, I mean, it looks the same as this. <laughs> I see some hidden secrets in here. Oh, I do own a squirrel ball. Okay. <laughs> Bones. Grave digger, spore digger. Use bomb. Miss the bomb. <laughs> right. Yeah, explode bots seem a bit too dangerous to be useful. I mean, unless you build your deck that way, probably. <laughs> Ruby Golem. Interesting. Right. There. Alright, what's hidden in here? What do we got? Okay. Enter a shovel somewhere, but I assume this puzzle is done. Oh, wait a minute. There are treasure chests around. Saw one there, but let me check out this one. Oop. Yeah. Ah, what? Sticky green goo. <laughs> is there Garangi? Garangi? Good, whatever. Series lights is back at you, then suddenly springs into motion. All right. <laughs> this creature would attack Force Mage. It does not. Cactus Mage. <laughs> Odd. Um. I mean, Plasma Jimmy might be able to take him out. Oh. Alright, we got a shovel, we got a skull. <laughs> there we 
go. Uh, nice. Guess I should keep killing these things. See if any more symbols appear. Okay. Skull, push, and flight. Um, oops, well, anyway, that's fine. Right. <laughs> yep, making good progress. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Can I take this candle? Okay. I mean, I've been able to use a candle as a sacrifice before. <laughs> so. Heap of smoking instruments. Oh, this is going to be a fire base guy. Probably red. Muscle mage. <laughs> Master Oily to direct deals damage directly, draw a card for each damage dealt. So that's kind of a neat idea. But again, I'm not specking for magic. Alright. Uh, yeah. There we go. Yay. Oh, right. I guess I could see the yellow gem, of course. Ooh, geez. Seems like you're not in good shape either. Just imagine your nice cube slowly melting in a hot pan. Oh, I was only talking to myself. <laughs> the pain of being ahead and bailed on his spirits. <laughs> well, it's worth it, of course. Magnificus will award me the highest honor. Oh, no. <laughs> well, seems like Magnificus is not a good guy either. <laughs> Again, maybe they're all bad. <laughs> See. Each night. Uh, well. Can't stop that mage knight from doing anything. Oh. Uh. Oh. So that means if it's alone, so maybe if I destroy this golem and then also the mox gem in its place. I assume. Anyway, uh... Um... Or I just attack it indirectly with this. If I come here. Claw back some of that damage. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay, so it's at the start of the turn that that's determined. That works. Or now I understand. <laughs> Um, put that there in case it'll come in handy later. All three of these golems are going to attack, but I can stop them this coming around. <laughs> Alright, okay. Yes, I think I've got an idea. Alright, so Mole Man will do all the blocking for me. I've also got enough bones for the Necromancer to take out one of these jokers. And could get another one with Curve Hopper. Sure. Oh, wait. Oh, boy. No, that was a mistake. I wish I could take it back, because this guy's going to have all kinds of power and is going to beat me right there. Well, oh, wait, at least the... No, never mind. The Mole Man will block one hit, at least. Oh, and then I'll maybe come back to... Or he'll give me more bones by coming back to life and dying again. Alright. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, oh, never mind. The orange mage doesn't gain power themselves like the green mage. They power up the other gems. Okay. <laughs> that would be very cool. Very clever. <laughs> we can call in hands. <laughs> All right. Um, do I want to just take this thing out? Yeah, I might as well. Sorry, right. elite bot. I'll let you go. Give me more bones. <laughs> Robot bones. <laughs> <laughs> just immediately dies. And, uh, that'll be a win. Hooray. <laughs> yeah, again, kind of got the... Kind of got a good deck rolling here, so... <laughs> Perhaps I will not be central to his strategy. <laughs> I care not. He can use me as a chump blocker. <laughs> I have master disappointment. Ah. Blue gem sacrifice. Draw three cards. Okay. Weird. Does seem like there would. Oh, and there's practice wizard in there too. <laughs> well, all right. <laughs> Third graduate student. There we go. Top sigil is found by the greedy. Bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing, or those who hear too easily. Oop. No, stop it. I want to keep reading the note. Yeah. <laughs> Middle sigil is found by the pale. Okay. So, I think I know what that means. So, bottom is the one that I found on the options, sound option screen. I know that. Oh, hi, Dolphin. Welcome to the stream. This will be the greedy. A rabbit. Kind of odd that that hasn't come up before. You reach back in for more, you notice the sigil or the card used to be. Alright. And. Last one. Whoop. Okay. else over here? Any secrets? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Alright, I kind of just flipped through it quick. <laughs> At last, stimulation. My tests have been sensory deprivation, you see. <laughs> to unlock full potential of my mind, you see. It's unlocked now. You hear me, Magnificus? I am ready. We have to battle? Okay. <laughs> Just eyeballs? Reminds me of the early fleshy stuff. <laughs> Hover mage. Good fly. Uh... Mm, maybe this could be okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I mean, yeah. What? I mean, all the all these students have been <laughs> terribly tortured. Clearly. <laughs> all right. So this guy's gonna die. Don't have to worry about him. Um. Oh wait. No, he's not. When this comes out. Um, ugh, well, better, better bring Hans out to, uh, deal with that then. Block these shots. I mean, I guess he won't be able to block the flying, but, uh, yep. And maybe I'll put Plasma Jimmy in here to kill this thing next turn, hopefully. Okay, good. 
died before. Jump cat. Alright, uh. Do want to take that shot. And. Sure. Get this ready for a sacrifice. Being sensible. Force Mage again. Hmm. Oh, so that guy's not gonna die because the Mole Man isn't gonna do damage. But I am just successfully delaying them until hopefully I get some more powerful cards. But I do need more. I wanna get this out of the danger range. Can I just shoot directly? No, I can't. Aw. Uh, well. Hmm, I mean, I guess I don't have anything to worry about from the Force Mage, so maybe I just bring out this factory. And then hope, in case I get a conduit. Nuts. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> ah, this means we get to play another. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> well, at least they're excited. <laughs> Okay, um, again, this doesn't feel like the best opening hand. Eh, alright, sure. Um, yeah, okay. Oh, right. Mole Man can also block flying. Okay. Maybe I didn't even notice that before. <laughs> um, Alright. Yes. Get that out. Okay, bring out the elk next turn. Or perhaps uh, something bigger. Ooh, the Ouroboros. Perfect. <laughs> uh, ooh. I mean, I, I'd want to maybe put it here to kill this thing, but... I won't, because then it would be blocked by the Force Mage in all future turns. Although sacrificing it makes it stronger. Anyway. Doesn't matter. Um. Okay, the Mole Man will keep blocking. Yes. Let's, let's start getting rid of some of these gems, hopefully. Well, that'll do 14 damage, which will probably win it for me anyway. So, but let's take out this gem anyway. <laughs> yep, okay. <laughs> kind of unstoppable at this point. <laughs> that was incredibly stimulating. <laughs> we aren't done here, right? I wish you see the light again to sing, to dance. You wouldn't leave, would you? <laughs> I mean, hopefully you'll be free when I deal with <laughs> Magnificus, <laughs> but... <laughs> yeah. Okay. If I open the door, you'll stop by on the way back and let me out. Right? <laughs> I mean, sure. <laughs> if I can. <laughs> Alright, Magnificus is very hairy, I guess. <laughs> oh, and it's a painter, great. Dearest Grimora, I believe PO3's plot to go far past the extent of a common pa there you go. Indeed, this great transcendence will have catastrophic and unpredictable results. I urge you to consider Yeah, it ends. <laughs>
is over here. Leaky pipe? <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> I mean, there were tentacles in the water at the dock also. I don't know if that means anything. <laughs> What's up? Ah, you are here at last. How do my pupils fare? No matter, <laughs> there are far more concerning issues at hand. Do you understand the canvas that you have been woven into? You... Uh, I mean... You paint on canvas, you don't really... I mean, I guess it's... Is canvas woven? I guess it is, but... Anyway, whatever. You don't weave other things into them, I don't think. <laughs> This thing, I'm a strand of the whatever. Anyway, you are the brush, and the artist moves with terrifying mastery. My eye aches with a premonition. Oh, it was his eye that I put in my head earlier. <laughs> Guess that makes sense. <laughs> the future is very grim. First, we must battle. Alright. Behold, the brush of the scribe of magics. <laughs> It's with a K, so you know it's serious. <laughs> My pupils would die to be painted by it, live forever as a card. That is not the full extent of its powers. It's got oh, it's got the gems in it, too. Cool. This one needs some bleach. <laughs> For a bit of color. Oh. Oh, nice. He got out. <laughs> Um, hey, bro, what are you doing? These are my fancy foil cards, too. <laughs> oh, provides all gems, but it's, it's also got a lot of defense. Hmm. Oh, oh okay, never mind. I was like... Is this curve hopper going to create other curve hoppers? But no, just rabbits. <laughs> also, I don't really necessarily want ruby mocks on my board, but anyway. Uh, let's see. I do want to kill the orange mage. Oh, but it won't actually attack since it has zero attack power, I guess. So... Hmm. Let's put this here for now. It can take one hit anyway. Probably sacrifice it later for the... Yeah. Get spiked, mage. <laughs> okay, so he's just gonna mess up all my sigils. <laughs> okay. So be it. Alright. Definitely gonna do Mantis God. Take out both those mages. These, these gem fiends are gonna be perhaps an issue. Oh, right, the Mantis God doesn't have its triple strike. Ah, I'm a fool. <laughs> All right. All right. Um, okay, what I need is blood. So let's get some rabbits in here. <laughs> All right, nice. Let's multiply some rabbits in here. <laughs> what is this? Draw a card equal to the amount of mox cards on your side of the board, which I don't currently have, but I could get them from the raven, I guess. Uh... Alright. Um, okay. So I don't want to take even one more hit. If I let things stand, it'll save me from dying, but I won't have as many blood sacrifices. Uh, I mean, I kind of want to bring out the raven, but it would leave me open to attack. Unless I put out another rabbit, too. Or I can just bring out the Mole Man and delay things, which I think I will do. 
<laughs> yep. <laughs> it sure did. <laughs> oh, nice. Good job, Mantis God. With your painted sigil. Oh, right, nice. The Mole Man has the retribution spikes. That's perfect. <laughs> Alright. Finally at four power. So I can... I kind of want to put the curve hopper in here to start doing damage over there. But I also kind of want to kill the green mage. <laughs> eh, actually, no. The, the green mage will be taken care of by the mole man, as will the gem fiend. So yeah, it's fine. Uh, and yeah. I could bring out the raven. Mm. Eh, I'll just leave this for now. Yeah, the mole man will handle things, and then I can maybe do some bigger plays later. Oh, what? Oh, right, the mole man doesn't have his usual power. Curse you, Hans. <laughs> you failed me. <laughs> I mean, you know, trusting in. Hans Mole Man, probably not. <laughs> probably not the most reliable guy. <laughs> Should have known. <laughs> okay, let's try again. The sigil's so colorless. <laughs> yeah, I was saying who aren't yet. <laughs> Um, alright. Yeah, so I've got to remember these don't have their usual powers. So this Pharaoh's Pets is kind of useless to me now. I mean, it's just a very expensive, uh, bone summon. <laughs> very cool that this guy keeps dancing. <laughs> but... Alright. So, uh, let's get a blocker. Actually, no, this is not a good hand. Let's re, re roll that. Do your painting if you must. What the hell? Oh, Headless Horseman. I forgot I even had that card. <laughs> it's a very expensive uh, bone summon, but very powerful. Uh, well, not a great early game hand, but we'll work with what we got. can you do? Well, I mean, it's better than nothing. <laughs> mm, yes. Alright. Well, I've got a potential blood supply here. But let's uh, take this out to do some damage. And maybe get a, a gem on the board. Oh, one away on that one. Okay. Alright, let's think. And this god will take care of Orange Mage next turn. Green Mage will kill the Ruby Mox, so that's a bit of a waste, but whatever. <laughs> I'll be able to get Curve Hopper out next turn, but I don't want to lose, so I guess Rabbit, you're you're being a, a chump blocker for me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, uh, Mox cards. Oh, nice. Actually, okay. Rabbit coming through with letting me kill that mage. Nice. <laughs> Take it. <laughs> Alright, now I can get that curve hopper out. I mean, of course, I want to destroy this super mox, but, uh, gotta deal with these guys in the meantime, I think. Uh, right. This will kill that, which will take away the power from that, so I don't have to worry about blocking it. Yep. Sounds good to me. Uh, 
Plasma Jimmy, purely a blocker, since I can't shoot with it anymore. <laughs> Alright. Alright, I've got the lead on the damage race, so let's start working this thing down. Because I don't think I want to leave that thing out for round two with this guy. Might get more stuff anyway. <laughs> Alright, well... Mm, yeah, let's just throw Double Gunner out there to perhaps die. Or, well, it'll, it'll kill the enemy. I mean, and if it dies, no problem. I'll be, I'll be building up uh, bones for later. Which I kind of also want. Now, speaking of bones, I could definitely do some sacrificing to get some more. Yeah, set myself up for using this Headless Horseman later. Why not? Uh, why not take out the Curve Hopper? Nah, we'll let it kill that guy. Sure, get a free rabbit out there. Or mm, bring this thing out. Just for sacrificing purposes. Good. This will kill that gem. Nice. Uh Too. Hmm, I must be slowing down with age. <laughs> I need to set my brush up on my own cards once again. Well, I mean, you're not looking good, buddy. <laughs> yeah, okay, and you just lose. <laughs> uh, yep, sorry. <laughs> That was a bit of a disappointing second round. <laughs> Alright. All four scribes defeated. Very well. We have battled. Now I may speak. You see. My eye. It aches because it remembers. It was excised. Yes, true. But another other than Leshy, the scribe of beasts. And a beast he is. Arrogant. Oh, right! When he was the wolf, he had a scar on one eye as well. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> and a beast he is. Arrogant, single-minded, obsessed with gaining power. But he is far from the worst scribe to become hegemon. You see, the ejection of my eyeball is far from the worst thing that can happen around here. <laughs> oh. You must be especially aware of... Uh... Uh-oh. Our, our plot battery ran out again. <laughs> you know what that means. Time for more of this. <laughs> Alright. Let's catch up with uh, this dude whose name I've forgotten. <laughs> and the powers arrayed against him. Uh, is this okay? I think the only thing. Sorry. Let me. Oop. Sorry. Let me refer to my capture. So, you're you're missing. Uh, there's like a. You know, there's an arrow up here for back. There's uh, just a battery timer in the upper left, but it always is full and says 400 minutes. So, <laughs> you're not. And I guess my I'm sitting over a logo that said Cam works again. But okay, this is all good. I think I just gotta send it. All right. To whom it may concern. Stop sending sunglass ladies to my house, please. <laughs> Hello there. Exclamation point. My name is Luke Carter, and I'm a Luke Carter, of right? Because he as plays cards. In my YouTube videos, <laughs> you know how appreciative I am of the merch that you send me to view. So it was a great surprise to learn that there is a digital version of these customers. I think maybe one of my fans pranked me and created a copy and enjoyed coming to town. 
Uh, during the research, however, I was not able to find any record of the killing. Is this some kind of elaborate hoax? Did we see this one before, though? Where is the first game? Is this some kind of elaborate hoax? Does anything seem like the work of a prank? Any obscure suggestion that may help? I am both puzzled and excited by this discovery. Any information you can provide would be much appreciated. Thank you. That will be covered. Okay. Good enough. Okay. I thought there was... I thought he sent some other email asking the company about... Oh, no, no. I think maybe it was... Anyway, whatever. Maybe I'm misremembering a different video. Hey, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this... Well, it's a bit of a strange video. Um, it's actually more of a question to my audience. As I've learned over the years, nobody knows card games better than you guys do. So I'm hoping someone could help me out. Did anyone ever play an inscription video game or hear about it? <laughs> I'm talking about that vintage one set card game I opened packs for last week. <laughs> I don't know what I'm allowed to say. I don't want to get in any trouble here. Um, I think I've got the only known copy of the digital version of inscription. <laughs> I've been uh, filming myself playing it and uh, it's weird. Guys, <laughs> uh, I don't want to get in any hot water by showing the footage, but can someone please prove me wrong? Please tell me someone has a copy of this game. I have been looking online for days, and I cannot find a word about it. I reached out to the publishers, hoping maybe you could get back to me, but as a fallback, I got you two different viewers. Hopefully you get back to me soon. <laughs> um, that's it. <laughs> that's the video today, guys. Uh, thank you so much, as always. And, um, oh, yeah. Uh, what the fuck is the car? Oop. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, do any of you guys know about the digital version of Inscription? It's really spooky. I got sucked in the game at one point, I think. <laughs> I thought there was. We would like to avoid taking legal action in this case, so please do not delay returning to proprietary software. Sincerely, James Singer, Customer Happiness Center. <laughs> what the fuck? I mean, I remember a th there was a s there was a similar threatening email. I thought about you must return this to us, please, or you know, uh, otherwise legal action. I, unless I'm wrong, but. Anyway, but also GameFuna hardware? I mean, he found this on a floppy disk. <laughs> Still nothing there. I think this woman's actually from GameFuna. She came to my door yesterday, and I didn't answer. This time I'm going to... Yeah, this is Sunglasses Lady. Okay, well, anyway, whatever. We'll watch all these. Because <laughs> there was that glitch, at least. Hi! Oh. Yes, for a game called Inscription. <laughs> also came by a copy of it somehow. Or or we saw some of this uh, before, but maybe it glitched no, like that. No. no, I don't know anything about that. Inscription, you said? Yes. No, I don't think so. Really? Because um apparently you emailed us about it. You are <laughs> a a Carter, right? Oh. <laughs> you know the lucky carter gmail dot com? Yeah, uh you know what? That's uh I am I've seen That's different parts remember. of the same thing. Uh, because uh, I've noticed that I've seen your videos. Oh. <laughs> on a VG. Oh. Well, <laughs> thanks for watching. Listen, uh, how did you know where I live, exactly? My boss gave me your address. And how did you get past the side gate? It's locked. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to give you my business card. And if you remember anything, anything at all, feel free to <laughs> give me a call. Okay? 
Will do. Take care. And then he goes, what the fuck again? <laughs> I think. <laughs> what? <No>. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't blame him <laughs> for that. Card gamers, I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. <laughs> Today I'm opening Secrets of Legendaria. Hoping for that sweet, sweet foil Balamir. Yeah, okay. Well, uh, the arrow buttons in case something else. Looking around for secrets. All right. Whoop, okay. Back to recording. All right, we've got par card packs. <laughs> Almost as if there's something after these four bosses, maybe. <laughs> Another sick droid. Nice. <laughs> hmm. He's just gone. Hmm. Oh, the other boss is also gone? It does seem like this water basin would be something. Alright, can we free the other mages or are they trapped forever? Well, oh, can't interact with that. Alright. <laughs> Alright, okay. I think I will. Oop. Oh, oh. PO3 is still here. Doesn't want to talk. Didn't do anything with his glitch card that I thought I got. <laughs> Let me take one more quick pop in here. Oh, you're still here. Okay. Maybe Any good cards for sale. Bone keep. Two bones to increase the power and health. Man, yeah, not really what I'm looking for. Eh, let's get another death sleep pack and maybe another beast pack. Necromancer. Ooh! Oh wait, here we go. Field mice. Okay, so that's from the beast deck. Maybe I can get another one of those and go to the combi the combiner guy. I mean might as well try. I don't I don't know if I need these foils for anything, so <laughs> Oops. Yep, yeah, alright. Come on, field mice. Can't Gamblebot? <laughs> A1 energy to set the power of Gamblebot randomly between 1 and 6. And that's kind of fun. <laughs> I call him Gamblor. And I'll free your mother from his neon claws. <laughs> it's a bunch of fish. Come on. Old man. We got another one of those. Not really that interested. Sector drone. I think I already had one of those. Come on, field mice. Because I'm kind of, I kind of want the field mice just so I can, like, clear that away and maybe combine a different pair of cards that I already have up. Ah, nope. No luck. All right. 
That's fine. Or, well, maybe I'll check just to see if the card choice has changed, just in case. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And then we go to those shrines, which... Nope. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Well, tough luck. <laughs> It is time, Challenger. Choose a scribe that you will replace. Alright, so here's a big decision. I mean... Oh, this is solid now. I can't go past it. Alright, so... Hmm. Now for the big choice. I mean, Leshy sure was a jerk to us. In that initial game. Uh, got the... Uh... What a grimoire <laughs> lady who, you know, despite being obsessed with the undead, does not seem so bad and was pretty polite as the stink bug. PO3 seems like a jerk and Magicka sure was worried about him. <laughs> okay, yeah, no problem. Thanks for jumping in. Uh, Ethy? Methy? <laughs> or. Ethy? <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Uh, but, I don't know, this Magicus does seem like he's, uh, you know, losing it and somewhat insane and also torturing his students, so, I don't know. Yeah, as much as Lishy you put us through, maybe putting Magicus out of his misery is the better choice. Alright, we'll go with that. Oh, wait, become the Scribe of Magics. Uh, no. I don't have my deck spec for that. <laughs> Although, maybe I could take those cards? Uh. Alright. Alright. If it's potentially based on the deck that I have, then never mind. That seals it. It's beasts. I'll be a beast. Like I kind of am. <laughs> Fool. <laughs> oh boy. You have no idea what could have what could have been? A carefully curated cycle of life and death. Excitement, terror, misery. That gormless angler has <laughs> once again failed me. I suspect that I know which scribe bested me. Of course. PO3. <laughs> Synthetic freak knows nothing of artistry, of aesthetics. <laughs> Monster, I like you better as a stoat. <laughs> Filthy old beast. I'll never be your stoat again. Now let's play. Oh. You're supposed to battle the scribe that you picked, but like a powered up version of the finale. <laughs> This is going to be different. Are you gonna... Are you gonna use the moon on me? <laughs> like, let's... Like, anyway. Well, the music certainly seems in rougher shape. <laughs> and I do like the flowery background that was around here. Okay. Oops! What the? Okay, I didn't want to put it there. I meant to put it here, but I guess I double clicked back and so I'll just leave this here. <laughs> I've got to give it to that treasure. Not as useless as I thought. Oh! So is it a thing of whichever one I picked is the one that. Ugh. The one that gets the glitched card? And because I picked him, I got it corrupted. Creature bearing an airborne sigil, something. Corrupted will something. An opposed. Oh, will maybe block? Okay, so it's got the flight blocking ability. That's fine. Ooh. Ugh. Wow. That's the ticket. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Oh no. What's happening? He's going, is he going 3D? Oh boy. Oh no. <laughs> I see. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh, she even unlocked balance of power. Hmm. Well, <laughs> I guess maybe I'm not done yet. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, hi, PO3. <laughs> hmm. Hello? <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Dick. <laughs> Look, I, I'm a fan of robots and technology stuff. <laughs> That's why I picked your deck. <laughs> I mean, now that you're now that I realize you're a jerk also, then <laughs> that helps. Ooh, holographic technology. Really stepped up. Or Uber bots. <laughs> Gotta get out of here and beat them. Why? From the great transcendence, of course. Doesn't matter what that means. You want it, okay? <laughs> I don't know. Magicus said I probably didn't want that, did I? Oop. Oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oop. Oh, just got like an entry-level deck, too. Ooh, these are cool cards, though. Ooh, also got a, a new upgrade to that book, too. <laughs> oh, that's neat. can actually target attacks. Okay. <laughs> and shield bot. Uh, okay, it's got, like, damage reduction. All right. And energy bot. Oh, just increases energy. Okay. Uh, what? Sorry. Topia used to be safe for travelers. Now rogue bots block all major roads. All right. <laughs> You're not used to seeing five lanes, are you? Ugh, that smug face again. <laughs> Let you could never pull that off. <laughs> Get my energy uh, thing. Oh, okay. I can still sacrifice creatures without. Have the blood to do. We got a techno scale. <laughs> this is really neat. Oh, yeah. Kill the 49er. Oh, it's a... Okay, it's a miner and a cart. It always looked like a like a car or something in the other art style. <laughs> it's not clear. Empty vessel. Okay. Uh, well. Empty vessel it is, I guess. Sure. Block that one attack. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't much care for the sound of that <laughs> techno bell. <laughs> oh no! Oh, they're right. They're they're floppy disks. What the heck is this thing? <laughs> is it a techno spider? <laughs> All right. Um. I mean, before this was the deck of squirrels, but maybe it's still a deck of squirrels. But I kind of want. My other from my existing deck, I guess. All right, energy bot. Uh, wait, does it have attack power? No, it does not. Get him out there, take that hit, and all right. Oh, explode bot. Ouch. <laughs> I want its bolts instead of teeth. Nice. Okay. Double gunner, not quite yet. Shield bots. Well, if I hit that explode bot, it'll kill everything. So. But if I do it with a sniper bot, 
that would save me from getting hit. Excellent. <laughs> Pow. <laughs> Oh, it flies over, right. Nope, can't click on you. Spider bot. <laughs> Alright. Still don't quite have the double gunner. Alright. So it is also weird to me that and and I have not I have not neglected to notice that uh the this time it seems like I'm going in the opposite direction. Like the character is going towards me instead of away from me. But maybe that's because I've... Am I the, am I the bad guy now? <laughs> that's why everything's flipped. <laughs> Curious. Anyway. You're gonna lose Spearman, and I'm gonna get a bunch of overflow damage. I'm not sure if teeth are still useful now, but <laughs> or I guess it's gonna be both. Yeah, space credits. <laughs> well, this is kind of cool. I guess I'm glad I picked him, although bad if he's the one planning some sort of great transcendence that'll ruin everything for everybody. <laughs> the best defense, other bots. Carry a spark that can uh, reactivate old bots. Add them to your deck, you know. Okay. Well, I mean, sure. Amoebot? Oh, it's got the amoeba amorphous power. Sure. Sounds like a good one. As good as anything. <laughs> do I truly wish to enact the Great Chance Sentence? You keep acting like I do, but... <laughs> okay. If you're smart, you'll use your items liberally. Sure. We'll punish them at a waypoint, obviously. Are you, I don't know. I'm not so sure about that. <laughs> I don't know if I trust you. Alright. Ooh. Exploding broken bots. Cool. Um... Wait, how much does it do? 10 damage. Okay. Uh, in that case, I think I know I can deal with this guy with an explosion. But uh, not yet. So, let's just block. Right. Um, right, I need three for the sniper bot. That's kind of the key to the plan. Uh, I can, oh, right, energy bot. Fill up my energy. Sure. Pass. That really cleared the board on me. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Alright, I should have known it was going to be the double gunner. I could have waited until a future turn on that. Uh, Alright. Oh, that shield bot will probably be protected once. But, well. Yeah. Five. You can do me bot and shield gunner. Oh, it's got the stinky power. Good. Um. If 
I send anything up against the explosion explode bot, it'll get killed, but also I need to do at least one damage this turn, and prevent at least two damage next turn. So... Okay, okay. I think I've got to kill the explodey bot just to clear these guys out. much as sorry me bot maybe in a future round you'll you'll help me out a lot all right oh it's got little speakers that come out of it that's right the little loudspeakers it's funny <laughs> all right okay Bam. <laughs> oh, not quite done yet. Good. I get extra damage. I'll take it. Another two creds. <laughs> Gift box. Card bearing the sigil. It's it's neat that they keep coming up with new sigils, like <laughs> and also this whole techno world here. When a card bearing the sigil perishes, a random card is created in your hand. Okay. I mean that sounds cool, especially with this kind of thin deck I've got <laughs> currently. What if I go back? Anything happen? Oop. Aha! Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> hmm, nice. Free money. <laughs> oh, so the walls. And, yeah, nothing else starting to land. Okay. Real best way to fight back those robots, modify yours. Give them OP abilities. <laughs> it sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, of course, floppy drives would have to be in uh, involved. <laughs> Alright. Um... Maybe uh, energy bots. It's good. It's a good quick one. Something I probably want to bring out early. So, oh, all right. Uh, that's it. Ah, uh, I wish I had something with a little more, uh, power that I put this on. That's okay. Um, yeah, just move, move and push. Let's go with defense, I guess. Have them take a hit. I mean, not especially satisfied, but <laughs> I'll take it. Set the waypoint. Don't choke now. <laughs> Guardrails? <laughs> Fighting on a narrow bridge? Alarm bot. Annoying <laughs> games one <want> power? <laughs> That's fun. Alright, um, I mean, I could put. Oh, never mind. I can't. Well, eh, sure. Empty vessel take the hit. Eh, and why not delay things and take him out with an empty another empty vessel? I mean I guess I could do it with a gift bot actually. Yeah. Sure. 
Bam. <laughs> Tomathon, just a basic 1 1 for 3 casting cost? Wow. That's not great. <laughs> or, you know. Can I smash the rails on this bridge? <laughs> I mean, why not? I'm cur kind of curious what'll happen. <laughs> and I can post a sniper there where you can't get at him. Yes, this is also have enough for a shield bot, I think. Yep. Is that oh swap bot. Okay. Oh, hmm. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, okay. Perishes, but that should include sacrificing. Oh. Or does it count this? Yep, it does. Nice. Alright. Um... You know what? I'm just out of curiosity. I really want to see what happens if I destroy some guardrails. I mean, it'll probably just keep replacing with new guardrails, but... Oh, right, I was gonna put out another empty vessel to block that swap bot. Oh, well. <laughs> well, that's the perfect blocker. Oh, wait. Oh, right, yep, actually, that'll do the job, I think. Maybe? Whatever, we'll see. Yep, zero health. <laughs> yeah, let's destroy this bridge. I'm curious what'll happen. Maybe I'll get an achievement. <laughs> uh, I can save double gunner for later. Yeah, okay. That'll... Well, I'll destroy the left side, at least. Okay. Uh, oh, draw a card first. Oops. Okay. Uh, and now... Oops. No energy. That's okay. <laughs> yeah, two damage will still... Me win. <laughs> I'm curious if it would. Yeah, cool. <laughs> also, you destroyed in this area will stay that way. And if you do perish, you'll be brought back here. Okay, it's an elegant system. Oh, like Leshy's go back to the beginning roguelike thing. Ooh, Central Rot Botopia. Oh, well, this sure looks uh, like a familiar map, uh, Mr. PO3. <laughs> now when I'm back to not being able to alter my deck. Of course. Anyway. Oop. Wait a minute. Uh. Sorry. Okay. I'm still getting money, at least. Hey. Glorious commerce. 
Your Robux are accepted here. Hmm. Maybe I'll keep saving up. I don't know what this rabbit is. Or what this thing is. And this, yeah, it's clearly a rabbit thing. This must be like a wizard thing? Well, anyway, we'll see. Very tempted and curious. Alright, uh, let's go to... Let's go back to the cabin. See what's that way. Servatopia, not much of value out this way. But you've still got to explore here. You know, for the great chance that it's... <laughs> down here. <laughs> okay. I bypass a boss or an enemy. Wolf hound. Nice. <laughs> Looks cool. Swapbot is does seem like a fun card to have. Yeah. <laughs> yeah let's get in more fights. I want that. I want those Robux. Oh god, it was Robux. <laughs> oh, thanks very much. <laughs> hope you have a good evening. Or I hope you have a good stream as well, I guess. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, with these Robux. No, that's not the name of the Roblox money, is it? <laughs> I, I wouldn't know. <laughs> Um, yeah, I could have brought out the energy bot, but I'd rather just deal with the alarm bot this way. Bring out the energy bot next turn, maybe. Yeah, the energy bot can kill it as well. Or, I guess it won't originally. Oh, I can also shoot it with the sniper bot. No, okay. Overkill damage doesn't count if there's no creature there. Right. <laughs> Alright. And sure, gift bot, why not? <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Bongo time. We're, I mean, seem to be rolling through this thing pretty well. I mean, again, it's what partially makes me think that this, uh, like, me winning, me actually winning this thing is going to be some kind of trap. <laughs> oh, yeah. It doesn't matter where I shoot. <laughs> oh, good. I get to, ah. Oh. Okay. Oh, Mebot has the sniper or the sentry gun thing. Uh, could. Sorry, I'm just thinking to myself what would give me the optimal amount of damage. And I think it's this. Smashy, smashy. Actually. Yeah, that's not going to do any attack power anyway, so also smash. Do, 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 one, one, one. Yeah, alright. Cool. <laughs> Was I seeing an eye? Eyelash titch, or sorry, eyebrow twitch there. Are you wondering about that, Sar? You've been winning a lot. You've got a bounty on your head. <laughs> okay. Well, <laughs> we'll see how that goes. 
Am I collecting like Grand Theft Auto stars here too? <laughs> oh, whatever. Bring it on. <laughs> All right. Hope everyone's having a good evening. Only been fun. Uh, yeah, let's put the gift bot over there to get killed. Because the amoeba bot have this time. Oh, I could have. No, actually, yeah, I didn't want to put that in front of the swap bot, or that would make it even more powerful. <laughs> what? Rust McShoot? <laughs> Robot Bounty Hunter? Great. <laughs> here only three I can take out both the automaton and the broken bot with the shield bot but I don't think I want to do that I'd rather have the shield bot out and have its defenses up for this rust shoot just to keep me alive I think Help this sniper bot have not much. <laughs> uh, oh, but I could post up a sniper behind the explodey thing and then just take pot shots at these other guys. Ugh, I'm running out of health though. Not good. Um, yeah, ugh, these, all these high cost guys. I think I might be dead here, <laughs> unfortunately. Oh, nuts. Alright. New energy bot and a sniper bot. Energy bot has no attack power, but it will take a hit, so that's good. Oh, and I, okay, and I can, like, no, can't do a me bot and sniper. Um, definitely don't want to use a me bot there, so, sniper it is, I guess. I can kill Rust McShoot. Yeah. Yeah, let's kill the Rust McShoot. Yeah. <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, I lost anyway. Shoot. Oh no! Uh. Okay. Oh, <laughs> well, Carter is still around. <laughs> well, alright. Eh, that's not so bad. At least I can get the money back. I was worried I wasn't. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Whatever. I'll just pass. Oh, I could have just brought out an empty vessel for no reason. Anyway. Actually, that's fine. I kept it for this time, so now I can... Hit him with it. Or, eh, use an energy bot. That'll, that'll kill it also, because it's annoying. <laughs> eh, why did I bother with... <laughs> oh, whatever, I'm 
Because it's going to take him in the opposite order this time. Okay. I can get down to business. <laughs> I mean, I guess the robot decks tend to, like, they, they, they have, like, a long ramp up time. <laughs> if I was, uh, trying to, what is it, evaluate it from a strategic perspective. <laughs> Alright. Three will kill him. Already doing two. Maybe I don't kill him this round, just to keep us going. Oops. That was a mistake, then. Uh, uh, I do want money. <laughs> no, actually, this is okay. So, no, this will do four. Ah, okay. Sorry, Mebot. Bad play on my part. Oop, I did it anyway. <laughs> uh, oh well. <laughs> okay, good. What's up here? Oh, more money. Good. Okay, was that enough or was it 27? What's this thing? Weird. Anyway, well, let me do this one, this other battle, and then I'll go back to the start. Forty er Um, ooh, I could put the gift bot next to the explosive. That would certainly activate it. Anyway. Let's take that hit though. Or gift bot. Nah. I think I want energy bot to go out. It'll block whatever anyway, so might as well put it there. And go. Mm. How much energy do I have? I'm gonna have four. So maybe sniper bot and a empty vessel. go uh ooh you know what I could do I could kill the swamp bot because if I shoot him with the sniper that'll swap his health and but then I can shoot him next turn and finish him off cool I think ah <laughs> oh, so close all right well I guess I'll be able to get gift bot out there. Bam. Oh, here comes another one though. I need to do some damage, but I finally have my six energy, which is exactly what I need. Oh, that double gunner is gonna die next turn though, unless I snipe the automaton. Yep, okay. Should be able to kill it this turn with a sniper. I think. There we go. Clear the board. <laughs> okay, you win. I can see. Let's move on. <laughs> Except surrender. Never. <laughs> All right. 
One, two, three, four. Uh, wait. Okay, so it is still five. One, two, three, four. Wait. One, four, five, six. So I'm already doing six. And let's do more, though. Let's open up that gift. Bolt Hound, okay. That's all of it, though. Yeah, might as well do all of it. Sure. Yeah. I would have done the same as if I did a me bot and shield bot. Bam, 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 bam. Bam. <laughs> cool. All right. Back to the store. And hopefully my whatever upgrades I make to my deck I'll keep. Wait, what? Let me guess what you're thinking. Go back to the waypoint and refresh your items. Maybe go to the shop. I actually want you to win, but it can't be that easy. Uh, you're going to go back to the waypoint. But all the rogue bots you've cleared in this area will respawn. So you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Those those first two weren't that hard. <laughs> Getting all Dark Souls on me? Oh, I'm one away from this. Alright. Let's see what the bunny thing does. <laughs> you actually bought that hollow pet? <laughs> it's worthless. <laughs> Take it to the trader and you'll see. Oh, so it's like rabbit pelt? <laughs> Where's the trader? I mean, I would think over here, because it's where the beasts are, but... Oh, right, I could have bypassed this battle. Sorry, everyone. I mean, in a way, it's good if the enemies come back, because that way I can farm Robo Bucks. But anyway, <laughs> I won't. I'll try not to do too much of that. <laughs> oh, it's already almost. It's already quarter to nine. Wow. Okay. So I guess there'll be another stream of this. <laughs> All right. Uh, Iron Box. Well, Energy Bot can take it out. Due to annoyance, or the sniper bot would have done the job also. That's fine. Alright. suppose the randomly occurring money comes back nope okay that's fine let's bypass this the bridge ooh item drop sentry oh I mean sniper bots are cool but I've already got two in my deck sentry drone would be good because I'm I don't have a ton of low energy monsters yet monsters cards whatever <laughs> ooh that's a more powerful arm bot alarm bot oh, it seems like it's supercharged <laughs> okay then Gotta make sure I block it then with the gift box, I guess. And, oh. I could have put a sentry drone there. That would have been good. Oh, well. I'll have to deal with that explode by next turn. That's one way of taking out the guardrails. <laughs> Ooh, so I need to... I really want to take out that gunner. Double gunner. <laughs> Um, oh, an energy bot, right. That'll up my 
reserves for later. Smash my own guardrails. <laughs> oh, nice. Touch of death. That's definitely something good to have for the swap bot. Um, or do I do this? That'll be good. Uh, <laughs> Alright, I could have taken out a sentry. But... Got this gift bot. UU177? Ooh. Transform to or from beast mode. <laughs> oh, is it supposed to be like Quill? <laughs> it's like a... Is it Sonic the Hedgehog with a gun? Is it, is it Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> Interesting. Alright. <laughs> okay. So... Get Swapbot to kill... Er, yeah, with the sniper. You can definitely get him. I do want to see what beast mode entails. Yeah. And I'll bring the double gunner out next turn to finish this guy off. <laughs> oh, it's like protective. It's got, yeah, protective mode. Anyway. Neat. Smash. Away we go. Plenty of Robux. Robobux. <laughs> right, Robux. That, that might be it. And then Robobux is in this game. <laughs> I don't know. Got a bounty. Hey, checkpoint. Items 100% charge. Okay. So, okay. So this energy cell just recharges. Oh. What? Lame. Power is dead on this old thing. I'll let you get up if you get a new battery. Ooh. I can't get up. <laughs> You're allowed in the inspection room only. <laughs> Let's get the battery from the inspectometer and come back. <laughs> can't escape. Or it doesn't have to. So there's his device that he uses to make cards. Sorry, I keep referring to him as he, but it's the robot. What the heck is this thing? Oh, it's annoying and maybe has sniper powers? Sprint progress looks complete. Hello. <laughs> yes, agreed. Hi, Chibata boy. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Hmm, it says print progress complete. Maybe I'm missing something. Anyway. I mean, we'll definitely pick this up next week. But, uh... <laughs> oh, okay, they've got these puzzle boxes, too. Okay. Well, I guess I will say, since we're pretty much at the end here, thank you, uh, those of you who came out to watch. I do appreciate it, and hope you had a good time. Uh, I'll be streaming on Thursday with Noida, and next Sunday, I'm not sure what I'll be streaming. Uh, maybe gonna play it by ear. And then I guess next Monday, I'll be playing more Inscription. Uh, okay, I'm gonna put that up there. And yeah, feel free to follow me on Twitter for updates on when I'm streaming, and check out my VOD channel on YouTube. Okay. So... I'm definitely going to set off this exploder. I mean, just having it out of the way, probably better, right? 
Do two damage here. This will set off that. And then it'll clear the way for another four damage. Yeah, this seems easy. What? Hmm. Uh, I'm probably missing something. All right. <laughs> All right, well, doing this, the explosion will take out this guy, and I'll do another one damage. How about that? Fine. <laughs> Ooh. Miss Bomb's remote? Sure, take it. Drop bombs on every empty space. <laughs> okay. Are you coming handy? <laughs> yeah, you're welcome, Sasha. What is that symbol? It looks like it used the Mox Gems. Oh, I think I see. If I set this up right. If I have my guy that gets powered up by have there being gems on the board. These two will get powered up. Nope. <laughs> or it's gems that I have, probably. Nope. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll figure that out less next time, I guess. <laughs> oh. Got the... That's where my book storage is. All right, the inspector's station. Oh, easy puzzles. All right, what? No. Oh. <laughs> this, this really is an easy puzzle. <laughs> um, the beehive thing. This is that how it looks? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Watching me. <laughs> Select all scores that contain cards. Oh my god. <laughs> what, can he not do this because he's a robot? What is this? What is that thing? Oh, is that like an actual thing from a... <laughs> it does look like a street scene from one of those uh, CAPTCHA things. Oh, something's coming together. Looks like. Oh, oh, the charge. Uh, hello. Hi, robot. <laughs> Oop. <Ooh>. Fish bot. <laughs> 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 uh, never thought I'd be so delighted to find the fisherman again. <laughs> Good. Oh, what? Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, yep. Hope everyone has a good evening. I think we will. I will give this to him next time. And, uh, I guess we will continue the journey of inscription. Oh, well, new game is yet again disabled. <laughs> of course. <laughs>